hi guys so this is my Easter look I decided to come on to make a video for you guys since it's been like going on like a two weeks or maybe I don't know maybe three I'm not sure how long it's been but um um yeah I just been really really tired and being lazy lately not that I have forgotten about my YouTube channel or you guys because I do tend to go on some time and see who messages me and I try to message every one of you back um, I'm not the type of person that I get um, messages and I get comments and people uh, wait for their you know to get comment back and they don't I'm the type of person that um, I will message you back and I will comment back even if it has to take me forever I will get back to you so um, yeah I just wanted to just let you guys know why I haven't been on. I've just been like really lazy and really, really tired. I don't know what's going on lately, but I think it has to do something with the weather change or, yeah. But now that I have forgotten about my YouTube guys and my YouTube girls. So yeah, um, this is an Easter look. And it has three different colors, which is yellow, bright green, and a blue color um, shadow. I wanted to add like a white uh, eyeliner in the inside of the water of the waterline. I added like a dark green underneath it, um, just to make it pop a little bit. And I added a brown um, a brown eyeliner. Um, there is no tutorial. I tried to do the tutorial, but there was just too 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 much going on today in my house. Like my kids were going up and down and fighting for things and everything. But I will let you know what I used today. Um, first, the first thing I did, I concealed my face with my Clinique Perfect, Perfectly Real Makeup, and that's, that's how the bottle looks. Um, I wouldn't buy this again, this cost me like 20 bucks, and I mean it's good if you want that like light, um, coverage, but in the beginning I really didn't know it was like a light coverage, I thought it was going to be like a medium, you know. But it wasn't, it was like really, really light, and um, it is the color of my face, but like the girl really matched it to, to like be like the color of my skin. But I really just don't like the coverage on it, it's like I don't like it. I, I, I really wish there was something like more, you know, with more coverage. And then on top of that, I added my Elf Complexion Perfection Powder, which has the three colors, which is green blue, pink and yellow and it looks like that and this is what it does it just illuminates any any part of the face that you want to illuminate like cheek, nose um, under the eye, forehead whatever it is that you want to illuminate you know what I'm saying, this is really really good I like it, my sister bought me this by the way, so you're blind you guys and it's by e.l.f. and again it's called the e.l.f. complexion perfection powder so you can't go wrong with this, it's pretty good, pretty good, and it, for the packaging too, it's really thick and strong, so I like it. Um, and then on top of that, I used my NYC New York Color Smooth Skin Bronzing Face Powder, um, and the name is In Sunny, and that's how it looks. And it's a really, really pretty bronzer, I like it, my sister also sent me this. And it's supposed to just make your face look like you've been in the sun all day. So, um, I try to contour it and everything. Um, I put it on my forehead, on my cheeks, right here, and my nose, the bridge of my nose. So, yeah. And then, I, I added my lipstick, which, well, it wasn't a lipstick, but it was like a, uh, a lip liner, which is called Coco. And this is by by Jordana and then I added my MAC my MAC um what is this called again? gloss and this is more like a lighter brown to the like a bronzy color liner not liner bronzer sorry I'm all over the place and it's really pretty because you can add it to your nudes or to your browns and stuff like that so yeah and and for my eyeliner, I used the Maybelline Eye Studio, and this one is in Brown Brown. That's the name of it, Brown Brown. And it's just the brown color. It's not too dark, too deep, or anything. I just didn't want to use like a black, 
being that, you know, these colors are so vibrant and, you know, light, I didn't want to use, like, a plump black, you know, for the eyeliner, so I just used, like, a brown, you know. But yeah, this is my look, guys, and I hope you guys like it, and, um, like, again, if you guys want a tutorial, let me know, and I will do it for you guys, um, let me get that a little bit. I just added like a beige highlighter to it, to my eye bone. And a brown, like I said, a brown lipstick. And I hope you guys like all oh, my nails. They're pink. Um, I don't know why I wanted to paint them pink, but I just, I love pink, so. And this is the color. It's a uh, Aethra Nail Wear Pro Nail Enamel. And it's a pretty, pretty pink. And the name of it is called Viva, Viva Pink. Like Viva, Viva Glam, a glam, some, I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but I think it sounds like the lipstick, like Viva, Viva the Glam, or I don't know. But yeah, it's called Viva Pink, and it's by Avon, sorry, wrong way. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little um, random video. Um, and let me know if you guys want to see anything in particular. I'm always doing like crazy, fun, bright looks, um, but that's just me, you know, that's a way of me expressing myself towards, to you guys, um, but if you guys want to see something more subtle, you know, more or less vibrant, um, let me know, I can do that too, so yeah, um, thank you to all my new subscribers for, um, subscribing to me, and, um, I want to give a quick shout out to, um, uh, Lady Diane, um, hold on a minute, hold on a minute, just give me a minute, give me a minute, give me a minute, give me a minute, um, Fancy Lady Diane One, I'm sorry, I'm like not all there today, Fancy Lady Diane One, um, she is such a sweetheart, she has a channel, um, a YouTube channel, which I said Fancy Lady Diane, um, one, um, she does, um, like, really nice videos, um, she does videos from, like, um, like, you guys gotta check her out, she does really amazing videos, she dresses, like, kind of, like, uh, back in the days, and I just love that type of, you know, like, what, how do you call that, um, uh, I hate when that happens to me, like, I get, I get, like, that block in my brain, like, guards. It's trying to come out, but it, it's not letting me. Um, what is it called? What is it called? Ah, um, sorry, guys. Give me a minute. Give me one minute, and I will find what I'm looking for. Give me one minute. Um, what is the name of it? Victorian. There you go. Um, it's, she just is sort of Victorian and beautiful, and... Just the way a classy lady used to dress back in, back in those times, you know what I'm saying? And I, I, I just love, I love that. And like, that, back in that era, I wish I lived back in that era because the girls just, they loved the way that, you know, the lace, everything. Everything was beautiful, like seriously. And that's just the way her videos are to me. She's just like the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. So, yeah, so it, her name is Fancy Lady Diane One. So go check her out. She's very beautiful. She has a daughter. Um, she also has a she also has a YouTube channel. Her name is Generation Gloss Glossy 1980. So check her out too. She's really pretty, just like her mom. So um, I just subscribed to her channel, and she does got a couple of videos out. She's doing really really great. Um, she's really pretty, like I said. Uh, yeah. So go subscribe to their channel, so Lady, Fancy Lady Diane won in Generation Gloss, Glossy 1980, so, and, oh, one more thing, my sister also has a channel, and her name is Isabel Bonito One. so make sure to check her out too, she just, uh, she just did her YouTube not so long ago, and she's trying to get her subscribers up, so can you please, um, if y'all can, Check her out and 
subscribe to her. That would mean a lot to her, and it would mean a lot to me, because she's my little sister. Well, she's not my little sister, but she, she's my little sister. She's 19, but she's still my little sister at heart, you know. Um, she's, 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 she's grown a lot. <laughs> so, um, check them out, and I wish all you guys a really, really happy Easter tomorrow, and don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and remember, if you guys want to see this look, just let me know, and I will do it for you guys, okay? Talk to you later. Love you.